mom, dad. <laughs> this is Nelson, my fiance. Nelson. Mm -hmm. Him? Yes, Hello. daddy. Hello, sir. Uh, dad, do you know him? Of course. That's my accountant. What? Your what? Didn't he tell you? No. For how long have you known him? Ten months now. Hmm. Which means he used you as leverage to get into my company. He's been working for me for the past eight months. Please, sir. Um, respectfully. I didn't use your daughter to get into your company. My credentials are there to prove that I qualify for the job and that is why I got the job. Please, respectfully, sir. Whatever. All I know is you're a digger, a gold digger, a liar! Now get out of my house! And I don't want to see you anywhere near my daughter again. Get out! So you've been deceiving me all this well? I'll never deceive you. On way. Yes, you I did. So why didn't you tell me that you're working for my father? Because of this very situation. I've been thinking this is how it's going to play out. I've been so afraid. Because I didn't want anybody to think that I wanted to get into your dad's company because of his wealth and I was trying to get to you. This has been my biggest fear since. And unfortunately, it played out just what I feared. Please, I love you very much. You mean the world to me. But you lied. You lied I, to me. I didn't lie. I just didn't tell you. And I've been trying to tell you since. Please. Amanda, please. Listen. I'm in love with you. I'm sorry. Nelson! 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 And where do you think you're going to? I'm going home. Your father will never accept me. I thought you said you loved me. I do. So am I not worth fighting for? If you truly love me, you will go inside and prove to them that you're real. That boy is a gold digger. Say criminal! Hmm. See, he wants to use our daughter to get to us, to, to our wealth. I should have gotten him arrested by the police. Honey, it hasn't gotten to that. Eh? Okay, has he stolen the company's money before? Mm, not really. So why are you calling him a criminal? Isn't it obvious? He used our daughter to gain access to my company. Honey, trust me. That guy is taking his time. He has an agenda. And he's playing it cool. First, he wants to get married to our daughter. Then he will, he will now transfer everything to him and make him our successor. Ah, that guy is good though. See how he's parading himself as if he's the owner of the company. He eats in the company. He even pays the staff without my consent. That boy is good. He operates as if he's, he's the owner of the company. But he has shot himself in the foot. I'm going to fire him. It hasn't gotten to that. After all, the staffs need to be paid. Or did he overpay anyone? Honey, you will not understand. After all, I'm just trying to protect our daughter. 
our daughter. Yes. Mm -hmm. Has he gone? Yes, Dad. He's <sighs> gone. Oh. God saved him. I would have gotten him arrested. Stupid boy. Giving him pay to, to come to my house to ask my daughter's hand in marriage. Eh? Is this what this is all about? No, no, no. That boy is a good digger. He's a good digger. Baby, I'm sorry for the way things turned out, mm. okay? It's okay, Mom. I'm fine. Sure, you're fine. Yes, I'm fine. I just came to inform you people that Mary has served lunch. Okay. So, people should come down and eat because I'm really famished. Okay, we're coming. We're coming. Right. We're coming, eh? Mm. I don't get it. What? Sh is she okay? Are you sure she's okay? She's fine. Why is she not bothered? About what? You just broke up her engagement with her fiance. And she said she's okay. Come on, honey. My daughter understands that uh, all that I'm doing is to protect her. My daughter is strong. She takes after her father. I mean, she's strong will, not uh, a weakling like you that uh, <laughs> attaches emotion to everything. Eh, eh. Stop it. Biko, please. Come on, I'm just joking. You know, I'm just joking. Come on, let's go and eat. Just joking. <laughs> Leave that. I'll take handily from here. Thank you. Alright. Thank you. Come sit. Dad. What is he still doing here? Oh, um, Dad. Please calm down. Eh! Hey, don't ask me to calm down. Did I ask you to leave my house? Sister. Oh, okay. Wait. Dad, if you dare call the police, I will run away with him mm. and you will never see me again. Amanda, has he gotten to this? Oh yes, Dad, it has. Dad, I really love him. Is it a crime for your employee to marry me? Can't you see that he's using you to get to my wealth? How? He's fake! He doesn't love you! How sure are you when you don't even know him? I know him because he's my employee! Okay, fine. You call him a criminal. Can you tell me one thing that he has stolen from you? Just one thing! Answer her. He hasn't stolen anything yet. Has he done anything to jeopardize your company? No, of course, he can't do anything to jeopardize my company. Has he not been hardworking enough? Honey, answer her. Well, he has been hardworking. Yeah. Then what exactly is the problem, Dad? He doesn't love you. He's not, he's not right for you. How do you know that? Uh, because... Uh, my he... son, you're welcome. Please sit down. Hmm? Thank you. Thank honey, you, Ma. Honey, sit down. We have to eat. So tell me, where are you from? I'm from Enugu State. Oh, nice. What about your parents? My dad is late and my mom is also from a new state. That's where she is. Sorry about your loss. Thank you. So I hope you communicate with your mom? Yes, I speak with her all the time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good. How did you meet my daughter? 
Ah, uh, it's quite an interesting one. She's a fan of Marvel's movies, and so am I. We met at the cinema, and while I was watching the movie, we, we got talking. And then one thing led to another, and we were communicating a lot. Interestingly, I realized that she has certain attributes that I like in a, in a female. Which is? Mom, I need to know. I want to know. Well, um, she's God-fearing. She's smart, intelligent, mm -hmm. extremely beautiful, and very sexy as well. Ah! Uh -huh. Ah, uh, yes! This little boy is telling you that our daughter is sexy, and you are saying ah! Uh -huh. What nonsense is this? Honey, honey, wait, wait, wait! Please, please, don't take it personal, okay? Let me talk to you. Honey, what is it? <sighs> Didn't you see how that Ninkom poop called our daughter sexy? What an audacity! I, I, I've already told you that that boy is a street boy. And he's not good enough for our daughter. Honey, that boy did not say anything wrong. He was just complimenting our daughter. Honey, please, stop making a mountain out of more hill. Honey, why won't you understand? Make me understand. That boy has an agenda, has an ulterior motive. Honey, tell me, what wrong has he done to you since you have known him? He eats in the office. Is that all? I remember you telling me that your new accountant is so hardworking. And I know you, my husband. You do not commend people. You find it difficult to commend people's efforts. Honey, why don't you get to know him? Stop being paranoid. Why is it that nobody understands me? You are the one who has refused to understand anyone. That boy is a gold digger. Honey, please stop this. Stop it. Huh. Baby, what is it? I'm worried about your dad. I mean, what? What is all this? You know, I, it doesn't look like he's going to accept me as his in-law. No, don't, don't say that. He will accept you. All you have to do is to prove to him that you're for real. What do you mean I'm for real? What does it take to be for real? Of course I'm for real. Look, I have worked with your dad. He's my boss. And I... From all indications, it points to the fact that he doesn't see me worthy to be your husband. That's it. No, that is where you're wrong. Yes, I know my dad may be your boss, but he's my father. And he loves me so much. And he can practically do anything for me. He just don't want me to fall into the wrong hands. That's why he's been very overprotective. Just prove to him that you're for real. And he will give us his blessings. Yeah, of course I'm for real. Please. Just try. Okay. I'll work on it. So that's what I saw. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Why are you crying? <laughs> what is it? It's Nelson. Nelson, what happened to Nelson? <laughs> Nelson abandoned me. I ran away with all the documents. I said it. 
I said that this boy was fake. But you people will not listen to me. You mean Nelson <laughs> abandoned you in this <gasps> condition and left with the documents? Yes, mom. Hey! Yes, mom. So, 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 all, 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 all my work, all, 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 all my estate, all gone. Ah, my hard labor. See, that boy, I told you people that he's not real. He's fake, but you will not listen to me. Now, see the result. See the result. I am going to hunt him down. I'm going to hunt him down. I'm going to destroy him. Wherever he's hiding, I will find him and eat him. I will kill him. I will hunt him down. Kill him. I'm going to destroy him. Honey. Oh. Uh. What do you want to destroy? Oh, that boy. That boy, that boy. Bless him, of course. Oh, I detest that boy. I hate him. Could you imagine? He, he impregnated our daughter and took all our documents and ran away. Huh. That is just a dream now. It's a dream. No, honey. It's not a, just a dream. It's a warning. It's a warning. Hmm. By the way, what is that boy? He should be in our daughter's room. What? Eh? No, 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 no. no. This, it, it cannot come to pass. What has come over here? Who's that? Commander, open this door. Dad? Yes. Open this door. Dead. I am so dead. Hey, just calm down, okay? Just open this door before I break it. Dad, I'm coming. Yes, Dad. What's he doing? Dad, he's my fiance. Your fiance, not yet your husband. Young man, come pack your things. No, Dad, he's Let's not go. going anywhere. Go to the guest room. Dad, this is not fair. Why are you doing this? This place is not a hotel. Does it look like one? Come on, go and get your bags. What is going on here? What's the noise about? Huh? Dad, I don't like this thing you're doing. I don't like it. Mom, Dad asked Nelson to go to the guest room. Follow me. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Why is Dad doing this to me? Mom, I'm not going to take it. I'm not going to take it. He keeps treating me like a child. I'll talk to your father. <laughs> 